Hey everybody here, Zero Cool here, back again with another video, and we're looking at the Unlimited X-Men. These are, um, they're a decent team with Rogue and Gambit, the other three are still kind of iffy a bit, only because, well, I haven't gotten to beef them up yet, so I'm not up there like a lot of people, but I've pushed as much as I could for Gambit and Rogue, because Rogue can be used in Arena, which is good. Gambit is a solid character altogether. Um, I wish they had more, um, maybe assists now or something like that, assists between the two, but they don't have that. But we're trying, we're gonna go up against some solid war teams here. So that way we could see if they can actually punch up or have to do punch across. Now, right now we're gonna go up against Web Warriors. We're gonna see if this takes hold. Uh, the Unlimited X-Men do get some a little bit of speed, but their their tags are more crucible based so hopefully we'll see something here uh both gambit and rogue are maxed out to the t so i pushed them to 87 and i pushed them up to g16 already so that's the only thing the other three i haven't really been able to do too much i did put the t4 on um sunfire's uh, uh special so that way he does get the 100% speed and then he does his turn his ultimate again. So on, on turn two. So let's see how that turns out Let's hopefully we get we, we're gonna go up against some bigger teams, too We're gonna try to go up against secret Avengers. We'll try to go up against um, Maybe Marauders and see how that works. They do copy, but we'll see how that that turns out if we can go ahead and Stun somebody or stop them, but we're going to see how this works going up against the web warriors the web warriors get a lot of drain and they go pretty quickly, so hopefully we'll see. Oh, we got to first, so let's just go ahead and, yep. Let's use your special on Spider going over there. That, that'll that mess him up. Oh, okay. I guess that deflect wasn't really working, but whatever. Spider Gwen's basically gonna be done. Gambit is about to wreck her and gone. Okay, so let's see if we can ability block Spider Punk. Because he's gonna give heal heal block and we don't want that. Let's see if we get stun Scarlet. Oh stun the man it. Alright, let's just go ahead and do the care bears there. Because why not? Sounds a lot better in in 1x than it does in 3, but let's go ahead and use Sunfire's ultimate. Didn't do too much damage there. He's not beefed up enough. Uh, let's see Phantomics on his ultimate. He could, nope, not getting there. He's going to probably be dead. Yep, Scarlet bounced. Um, well, we don't have the charge, so it won't ability block, but let's get the both of them over here. Oh... Oh, and probably just trip him up and that's it. Uh, let's go here. Boom. And he gets to go again. Might as well do it. Yeah, and we won. So he gets a little bit of extra damage from the offense up. So that pretty much. So that we, they, they didn't have too many. Um, they're not going to have. They're going to have more actual buffs in war. So that could be a little bit difficult. But. Having Gambit at Rogue at, at 16 and that big of a punch up was actually quite nice. All right, we're back here again with another one. We're gonna go up. We're gonna try a a near 400k punch up with Unlimited. We're gonna see if we're gonna be able to take him out. They even got Fury on there to give a little bit extra, just a, just a little bit extra to Kestrel. So it's not that big of a, a help, but it does give her a little bit of a health in there. And then we got a Teal Gear. Captain Sam and then Sharon and Rhea. So let's see how it runs. Let's see if it goes well. I I'm unsure if it will. I mean, Unlimited's fast. These guys are faster. They're gonna get some speed too. Pretty sure Captain Sam's gonna knock out at least one or two of the Unlimited X-Men when he does his ultimate. But we're gonna see if we can go ahead and knock somebody out. Gambit's gonna be pinging, so hopefully it it goes well. All right, who's going first here? Fury's going first, but he already got he already got whacked. Um, 
should we go with Captain Sam or Kestrel? Um, let's see if we can get in on Captain Sam. Ah, he resisted. Should have went for. Oh, and she blocked. Oh, that was great. Just, just Kestrel's ultimate just did nothing. All right, here comes three more. That's fine. She's got defense up. We're good. We're good. Yep, still defense up and the immunity, so you can't stun her. And Fury's gonna be going. Or Sharon, whichever one. Let's try to ability block Maria. We can. Ah, nope. She's still too much. Uh do the care bears there. Might take out the might get them down to death proof. Yeah. They might kill her. Um Let's just do his ultimate. Yeah, he's, he's trying. Uh, let's keep going after Maria. She's blocked anyway, so that's good. I didn't think it stuck on her, but it did. I thought it was only left bleeds. I guess I couldn't see it because of all the all the people that are around here, so that's good. Uh, let's stun Kestrel. Screw it. Oh! Oh! We got rid of him. Oh! Oh, and they... It, wow, Teal Gear Sam couldn't didn't take one of them out oh wow this is that was a big punch up for unlimited that is ridiculous go ahead hit her again boom wow and unlimited did a 400k punch up on secret avengers that is nuts All right, we're back for another one. We're just gonna try Secret Avengers. These guys are gonna be damn near tough. It's only a little bit more than a 200k punch up, but let's see where it goes. I'm semi-optimistic, but these guys are gonna get a lot. Young Avengers is gonna do, they're gonna do a lot of turns right off the bat, and it's probably not gonna go favorable right away, but if they can target Rogue or anything, that would be great, but since we're faster, let's just go ahead and make sure they don't heal up or give that heal block. So, boom. There you go. It's stuck on Squirrel Girl. She's she's done for two turns. Did they get the block? Did we get an ability block? It usually shows. No, there's no ability block. Oh. So we're going to have to stun her turn. If we can, if we can ability block her now, let's see. Yep, we got her ability blocked, so that's good. Uh... Let's go ahead and do the Care Bear Stare. Yep, there's still an energy there on the other side, but KTO block, so that's good. Uh, who do we want to? Let's do Echo since her, since she's gonna be pinging. Let's just go ahead and see if we can stun her. Oh, there we go. All right, let's see if this Sunfire can do anything. There you go, didn't really do too much. But it, when, when he gets that offense up, it might help. Dazzler's blind, so that, that's good. Put it on somebody that doesn't matter. Uh, we're stuck on Miss Marvel for right now. But it sent it over to America Chavez. Uh, here we go. Boom. Ooh. Uh, let's see if we can black Squirrel Girl again. Uh, no, that's right. He's got no charge, so it won't work. This is fine. Now, can we get rid of somebody? All right, here we go. Offense up. He's got a few offense ups right now. Let's see what happens. Go. Yeah, we got Squirrel almost down. If she heals, it's gonna be bad. Who's going next? Oh, she might. Oh, Squirrel Girl tapped out. Squirrel Girl tapped out. We tried to keep going after Squirrel Girl, and she tapped out. So, usually once once Squirrel Girl taps out, the team usually falls apart. Right now, they're kind of falling apart. Uh, we might as well do his ultimate just to get some damage. Oh, and we knocked out Kate. Oh. Okay. Oh, there we go. Missed. And oh, she tapped out too. 
Now there's just America Chavez, and she's just a little bit of a brawler that can take a hit, but that's about it. Oh, wow. And they're done. So, probably more room bonuses. Some other stuff will go ahead and push into that. But they are limited, it seems, to be a soft counter to the Young Avengers. They were, I was expecting them to go faster, but... So if Rogue and Gambit can stay afloat, then they sh the Young Avengers should fall. But see how it is. Now we're going to do about a two, maybe about 190k punch up on the Marauders. Um, Madeline is just, a, she just wrecks people. And we already know that Sinister is going to clone somebody unless we, unless we try to take them out. But we're probably not. I don't think this is going to be a good counter, but let's just see anyway what they do. It'd be, gra it'd be great just to see or kind of anticipate it, but I don't know. I don't know. Oh, they already st well, they stunned Phantomex, which is great. Uh... Yeah, let's clear all the barrier off of him. That's gonna that's gonna be nice for him. Oh, he still got it again. So I don't know if this is gonna work. Oh, that was bad. All right, so we got we got all kinds of garbage everywhere. Uh, hit everybody. Resisted it. Let's go. Boom, 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 boom. He took the hit, but oh, now we're ability blocked. So yeah, this isn't gonna go well. Oh yes, go ahead. Waste that on Phantomex. That's fine. A little while ago, I thought it was gonna be Madeline going, but no. Yeah, they seem to be going after Phantomex. So. Ah, and Gamut's blinded, so that just messes up the whole, the whole, just, Gambit can't be blinded, so, we're getting wrecked here, it's nuts, just, yeah, he can't do much, he's blind, so at least the blind goes away, oh, and you stunned our rogue, yeah, we're getting, Yeah, they're just getting... I thought Rogue and Gambit could try to pull it off, but... Eh. Rogue gets some good healing, but not enough. Yeah, that was a big power move. Can Rogue do something? Won't stun him, but... Do some damage, but that's about it. Yeah, but it's not enough damage. That's the bad part. It's not enough. Oh, Gambit's stunned. Ugh. Gambit's stunned. So. All right. Let's just finish it off and then go from there. Yeah, this one's this one's bad. It was a good try. It, it really was. And if I maybe if they had more sustain, maybe if they were around the same level as everybody else, they could. But Rogue is still holding her own. She's trying to knock out Strife before you go. Okay. Rogue is wow. Hold on. Let's see if we could use this on something. Can we? Oh, you blinded. Oh, you're screwed. Yeah, you're screwed. Well, there it is. They're not even a soft counter. All right, so now we're going back again. We're going to try against Unlimited X. Well, I'm going to try Unlimited X-Men versus the Axemen. It's going to be a damn near 400k punch-up. Why not? Let's just see what happens. I mean, it's not going to, it's not going to mess up anything for it, but let's just go ahead and try it anyway. We're not going to lose anything, but definitely want to make sure that we could try to get through them maybe with just two and the other three are kind of just there 
you know? All right, let's check it out. Um, let's just, we need to ability block or stun beast, so. Okay, dodge that one, that one was nice. Uh, there, Gambit's gonna snap off again. He dodged it a little bit. Oh, Gambit's blinded, see? There's where, the, there's where the fun comes in. He's blinded, so he can't do what he needs to be done. So, just go ahead and trip him up and do that. We got defense up at least. Uh, they're going after Sunfire, so that would be... Eh. Yeah, he's going to miss until Gambit goes. Okay, the blind is off. That works out. Cool, you stunned... You stunned... Uh, Pentomix, that's good. Can we stun Beast? Hopefully. Yeah, she's dodging Gambit like crazy. Look, they're gonna... Yep. Alright. Uh, they, yeah, they tried. They stunned him again and got rid of him. That's weird. thought the AI would switch it up. Uh, yeah, they don't seem to be fast enough to keep going now that they lost two, two of them. Uh, Gambit's snapping off now, but they would have blinded like Dazzler or another one that would have been great. Okay. He's trying to take the hit, but he's blinded. Can we get Rogue? No. Nope. We're not going to have Rogue go. Yeah, Rogue's out, and we lost. So, Unlimited X-Men is a freaking no-go. It was looking like it was going to be it, but not. All right, just for shits and giggles, just to end it off with it, let's see if Unlimited X-Men can go against uh, Weapon X. It, they probably won't, but, I mean, we could try just to see. You know, it's just, just testing it out. I mean, this is for us mid-gamers that aren't really... We can't buy everything. We can't push everything. We're just trying to use what we got in any of the game modes and any of the milestones any of the events to try to win so he already went wow taking out a chunk there uh yeah they're going first really quick but at least gambit snapping off and not doing too much damage and now she slowed him down now slow down rogue there you go boom yeah they're going after rogue uh let's just go with the care bear stare yeah it did absolutely nothing yeah, they took out Rogue. Wow. Took out Rogue. Yeah, Weapon X. Weapon X against the Limited. Eh, seems legit. Seems legit. So, it is what it is. They're gonna, they're gonna lose right now, so. Gambit's holding up, though. Wow. The defense up. But they, we really haven't done anything in terms of damage. And Phantomix is the last one. Why? Why? Well, all in all, Unlimited X-Men is a decent team. They're well-rounded. If they're all on the same playing field, it might help even better. So once I get Phantomix, Dazzler, and Sunfire up to a decent level to maybe somewhere in the 80s, because right now they're all basically level 70 and under, so they're not performing as well as they could, but eventually when they get to that point, maybe they'll do something decent. Um, but it's going to take a while, because hey, I'm a mid gamer. I'm not spending bukus of money on everybody here. I'm trying to get them as free to play as I can and then just go with whatever resources I got, but resources are dwindling so but i give unlimited uh, unlimited for us for newbies mid gamers if you can hit gambit or if you can try to get rogue on the second scourge run it might help she does do some wonderful things in arena she's a very very good character in dd5 and or in dark dimension to begin with so she is really really good because she blocks and then stuns so it's great and she heals on every turn so that's even better she is basically a really good legendary so Gambit is a little bit further behind, but the one part that gets them gets him good is that he is pinging off of everybody's, off of every enemy's turns. Whenever an enemy turn takes a turn, boom, 
he's hitting back with piercing damage. So he's probably a really good character, but only on this team. Standalone or plug and play, he's iffy, but he does got some drain to him, but that's only in his ultimate, and that's only when he's in stealth. So that's the only part that's a little eek. But unlimited, not bad. Soft counters, maybe a hard counter to a couple, but a soft counter, hmm. Uh, we'll check it out even more once war starts and then we'll see see once the actual room bonuses are in there and see how much harder these teams can be but <sighs> until the next video Deuces.